The Makeup Factory, a fictional case study presented by Team One, consisting of Lindsay Dykes, Amy Shelton, Faith Kerr, Susan Baker. After years of working for larger beauty companies like Ulta, Sephora, Mac, and others, Leah and Jane decided they wanted to open their own beauty store. This beauty store would have vegan products and treatments and be all-inclusive. They wanted to create the newest, trendiest makeup store in Annapolis, Maryland. And that's when they come up with the, the idea for the Makeup Factory. After years of developing and creating, Leah and Jane's vision was finally complete. The Makeup Factory opened its doors in 2015. This is the Makeup Factory's management team. The management team consists of Leah, Jane, Grace, and Troy. Jane and Leah are both owners of the store. Jane's duties include seeing, overseeing all aspects of the store. Leah is the general manager and deals with day-to-day -day operations. Troy is the assistant manager. He assists Leah in the day-to-day -day operations of the makeup factory. Grace is the sales floor manager. She manages the sales floor as well as trains most of the employees. The makeup factory also has three spa specialists. Their names are Gabby, Bree, and Mary. They are trained to perform all spa services as well as be knowledgeable in the products used in the spa. The Makeup Factory is known for selling luxury and high-end makeup products and accessories. Their following products include makeup, makeup accessories, hair products, nail products, fragrances, and skincare products. The spa services include Skincare consults, facials, eyebrow waxing, eyebrow tinting. The Makeup Factory hosts many events and beauty informative seminars. These events span over the entire year. Some of the events include charity events, prom makeovers, new product tutorials, and brand promotional events. These events are planned by the management team at the Makeup Factory and are executed through the management and sales associates. The Makeup Factory's mission statement was developed by owners Jane and Leah. The mission statement reads, To create and inspire a professional and knowledgeable group of individuals who have expertise in the beauty industry that can help consumers enjoy, learn, and understand the beauty industry and their products. Organizational culture is the shared understandings, beliefs, values within the organization and usually define the internal operations and employees' performance. The Makeup Factory has a culture that empowers employees to make decisions that stand behind the mission of educating their customers and introducing products that can add value to their lives. They do this by promoting new product lines weekly. The Makeup Factory has achieved a competitive edge over larger beauty supply stores such as Ulta, because they provide an inventory of products that are environmentally safe. Their beliefs are that every employee is the public face of the organization and that it continues to remain the cornerstone of their success. The organizational structure is a system used to define the hierarchy within an organization. Everything from rules, roles, and responsibilities are considered to be a part of the structure regardless of the size of an organization. The Makeup Factory's management team has a minimal span of control of each employee. Within their organization, tasks are assigned 
based upon the employee's particular job position. A great example is how their sales floor associates are trained with the knowledge of promoting and introducing their customers to weekly events and seminars being held at the spa experience floor. Some recommendations that could be made to improve the makeup factory's success in the future is more hands-on training with employees and spa specialists, better communication between the management team and all of the employees, and more involvement of employees in the planning of daily operations, products, and events. Thank you for watching.